Hello friends, my name is Kishan and welcome you in this video tutorial. Uh, in previous video tutorial, I had created this project, a Spring Auto Wired Annotations. So here basically we had created uh, two classes, employee as well as PAN card and here employee contains the reference of PAN card and PAN card we have basically injected using at the rate auto wired within employee. So uh, we had learned in previous tutorial at the rate auto wire we may use before the property name or before the public setter method, setter, uh, uh, method. So, so here how it works so if you specify at the rate auto wire before the property or before the setter method name then a spring first will take the property name and a spring will search any bin uh, which in the configuration file with this name if any bin is available uh, with id pan card then that will automatically inject it okay so here variable name is pan card and we have a one bin which has the id pan card so uh, automatically this will automatically inject it using auto wire so this is first spring will try to resolve these things using uh, uh, using by property name even though if you specify the property name anything else like pan card to but here uh, you have a variable name as a pan card still this will get resolved let me show you let me run this application then you, this is getting resolved right so how it happens basically a, a spring first try to resolve these things by name auto wire by name a spring if does not get any bin, bin with name pan card then a spring will try to resolve these things by type auto wire by type so a spring will go to the xml uh, I mean, a, a configuration file that will try to find any bin with the, the type as pan card so of course we have a one bin which has, the, which has the type pan card so this will get automatically resolved even though if you do not specify bin id still this will get resolved so let me show you i have removed id and it's getting resolved so this way spring resolves first uh, uh, spring will try to resolve by the name and after that uh, by variable type if both gets failed then spring finally will throw an error now same project i am going to copy over here and i will post i will paste into same project the same workspace i will give the name a spring auto wire auto wire annotation before constructor so let me close this previous project and here in employee class i am going to delete all these methods and here all these three fields i would like to initialize using a public constructor so go to the source and generate constructor using fields now let's generate a public setter method for all these three properties so select getters now here we have used constructor right so auto wiring cannot happen for the primitive type or a string data type auto wiring only happen for the custom data type so here we have used constructor so these two fields we have to initialize explicitly but for third field we may use auto wire so here i am going to use at the rate auto wired annotations so auto wiring will happen only for this third variable but these two variable of course we have to initialize explicitly using constructor based dependency in jc constructor based dependency injection in configuration file so here instead of property based I mean setter based dependency injection we have to use constructor based dependency injection so constructor name and value right so this line of code I am going to write twice now first property we have a employee ID 
so employee id provide some dummy employee id now second property we have a employee name so let's initialize employee name as well so employee name i am going to specify son murphy but third variable we have a custom data type so for this we want to use at the rate auto wire and name of, name of the bin is pan card with the same name we have configure one bin over here so of course we can uh, use or at the rate auto wire right so let's go ahead and run this application so we are successfully able to retrieve the employee information as well as cross corresponding pan card details so this way uh, you can uh, use at the rate auto wire before constructor as well so let me recap these things uh, or that it auto wire you may use before the property name before the setter with setter uh, method name or even though you can use at the rate auto wire before constructor so that's all i wanted to cover in this video tutorial if you like my video please like and subscribe it thank you for watching my video see you in next video tutorial